Welcome to VL Academy. In the video, la, Departmental Accounting Other Exercise Problem Number 17, nama paaka poorom, which is in page number 17.31. So, right from this problem, nama enna pannu hoong apdina, it is selling price la hoong transfer pannu irukkaanga. Adil la erindu nama stock reserve edith, adil nama general profit and loss account prepare pannu, adil la erindu stock reserve account chai actual profit kandu poori kundu. But in the problem, we have general profit and loss account prepared. We have a hint that the stock reserve is not reduced from net profit. So, stock reserve is not affected. So, in the problem, we have to make ratios. We have to make two departments of the same values. So, we have to make it up. 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 So, now let's see trading account. On debit side, it's opening stock that is 30,000 and uh, end department can the opening stock on Kadaya. In our M department, lend the end department goods. Wangranga. So, I will continue in the purchase on Kadaya, the opening stock on Kadaya. So, purchases is 2 lakh 10,000 for M department and end department Kavanda. Yum department 50,000 worth goods when the transfer Panir Kanga and all other debit side Nama Kamchurko that is for end department and on credit side Pathina buy sales. There is 2 lakh for M department and 60,000 for N department and transfer of M department. Now, previous problem where I mean, debit side liya the less pani kaam chirke, but idhila vandha nama credit side vandha uh, M department la kaam chirkoum. So, both have, both will give the same answer. So, nige eppidi vana lo apply pani kla. And closing stock is 40,000 and 10,000 for M and N department. Per end side on total pano na will get a debit balance as gross profit. That is 50,000 and 20,000 for M and N department. Grand total is 2,40,000 and 70,000 for both the department. So next one is profit and loss account. Profit and loss account will draw down the gross profit. So uh, gross profit is 50,000 for M department and 20,000 for N department. And credit side varavi in the item in the discount discount receipt. That is 2500 and 1000 rupees for M and N department. Now, debit side is salaries that is 12,000 for M department and 1000 for N department. And other expenses 3000 for M department and 500 for N department. Postage 500 for M and 100 rupees for N department. Now, end side on total we will get a debit balance as net profit of 37,000 for M department and 19,400 for N department. Grand total on both the side is 52,500 for M and uh, 21,000 for N department. So the next one is calculation of stock reserve. In the problem, we have a percentage of stock reserve. So we have stock reserve affect our brain. So we have a hint. So we have book answer to the stock reserve calculate. So we have a calculation of stock reserve. We have a stock reserve. First and foremost step is gross profit percentage kandu pudikkunu. So, adha eppidi kandu pudikkunu apdi inna? Adha avudha, oru department, enno oru department ku goods tharangal liya, in the department goods tharangal lo, and the department oda gross profit divided by credit side la closing stock at avare, mit items ellami nama total pani, adha denominator apoottu into 100 poodnu. Once again, I am saying, gross profit of M department divided by credit side total except closing stock into 100 okay so we'll get 20 percentage Ipo elements of m department closing stock of n department so n department order closing stock la num in the 20 percentage at them now that is the stock reserve so 10,000 into 20 divided by 100 is equal to rupees 2000 so in the problem of portori if leather calculation but uh, in case on the uh, closing stock percentage adala kudutan nangana we need to give few more steps adha vandu 18th problem la nama paakalam indha video va watch pannadhukku romba romba thanks indha video nijamave ungalku pidichirundhaduna like pannunga share pannunga and subscribe pannunga thank you once again